guys welcome to our SLGIS assistant YouTube channel hope you are enjoying with my previous lessons and sample data sets so definitely you should be gain knowledge about editing data representing data and more data analyzing tools so today I am going to explain about creating a team model using geographical data triangulated irregular network it means team model used to represent high data by a basic 3d model this will help to get a rough idea about variations of terrain and shape of a surface. Okay, let's start our lesson. I have some spot height data of a particular area. I am going to add the data to our map window. Click on add data button. I have some spot height data and I am going to add the data for this window. You can see there are spot values in this column, TP, EL column. Now we are going to create a thin model using these spot heights. To do this, browse up toolbox, then click on 3D Analyze Tools, then go to Data Management and expand thin, then double click on Create thin. The output team model has already created in default database. You can change the path from here. Coordinate system is optional of this box and we can input features as spot height data and you should be set the height field as TPEL data because this column has elevation data of this layer. Then click OK. Now you can see the team model has created with default classes you can see the elevation field from this attribute table if you want to reclassify these classes or if you want to reclassify these classes with your own defined classes you can right click on the tin and go to properties under the classification tab you can change the number of classes for this tin model I am going to change the classes as 15 and click on apply ok now the key model has classified to 15 classes or oh, if you want to classify these to your own classes go to properties then click on classify tab under the method you can change the method as manual and you can change the class values from dragging the class intervals then click okay now the classes has defined to your own numbers by using these tips you can reclassify your tin according to your requirement and gain a good tin model for your surface For better 3D view, I am going to open this model in ArcScene. ArcScene also can be installed with ArcGIS software package. First, open ArcScene. I am going to add the tin model by clicking Add Data button and go to home folder this is the thing I have created now then click ok by clicking left click you can rotate the model because this is a nearly flat surface the height variation cannot be seen clearly so we can enhance the elevation factor of this model right click on tin model then go to properties and go to the base height tab under the elevation from features you can change the factor from this dialog box I'm going to change this as 5 then click apply ok
by rotating the model you can clearly see the elevation variations of this area I will show you a nice trick of this Axin window. There is a tab called as Fly. You can click this button and click on a surface. Then you can see there is an automatically rotating view as shown in the sky. Okay, now you will be able to create a model using geographical data and visualize them in our scene. How to explain about shade analyzing tools in team model and creating videos using this kind of 3D models in my next lessons. Please leave a comment regarding these lessons and your suggestion. Hope to see you soon. Don't forget to subscribe and share us.